That's yeah, really Katie annoying. Perry. <laughs> Katie Wait, that's Katy Perry. Hmm. I guess she's doing alternative modeling now. No, Brandon, that's not alternative modeling. Just changing your hair it's color. Girl. Yeah. Brandon, alternative modeling means that you have tattoos. Like, that's it. It doesn't mean you changed your hair color. And also you're a part of Suicide Girls. Yeah. Okay, good. We're still good. Yeah, and we're, we've been recording this whole time. Okay, so back to magic times. Oh, yeah. Not Katy Perry. Magic. I mean, Katy Perry's great, too, but, you know. I think magic. about her sometimes. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we're going to be doing an unboxing, and we're going to be doing some drafting. And what are some... we doing an unboxing of? Magic Origins? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, Is anyone They might be. That possibility. There's one person. Here, although we can't show you her because we don't want to mess with you. <laughs> I thought you were going to say something else. What? She's in witness nothing. protection. That's why we can't show you. <laughs> Man, this is using up so much of my uh, RAM. <laughs> Alright, that's enough about RAMs and other goat-like objects. Let's mm -hmm. talk about magic. Yeah, so like we said we, before, we're going to be doing a draft. Brandon bought a box at his local game shop, and he got a promo card. Yep. It's... Comic Mania, thank you for the promo card. That's it's awesome. called Relic Seeker, and... It does things. It, when it becomes renowned, you may search your library for an equipment card, reveal it, put it into your hand, then show for your library. That might be good in, um, modern. Yeah, right. I wonder if it's gonna get banned from standard, like, Stoneforge Mystic. Yeah, exactly. It, it's not a, a Stoneforge Mystic, but it seems like a Stoneforge Mystic It's cheaper type. to cast, though, so I'll say that. Yeah, but you only get one, though. Um, okay, so let's uh, open this baby let's, up. Let's tear this bad boy open. With your um, custom engraved knife there. From the Great Smoky Mountains. Of Tennessee? It says Great Smoky Mountains. Do they have mountains down there? I think so. Okay. I'll take the knife's word for it. <laughs> yeah, really. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, guys, so what we're going to do is the most fun format I know of. No, not Tiny Leaders. Ha-ha! <laughs> ha, -ha. <laughs> ha, -ha. <laughs> Nope, we're going to do Pack Wars. What does come next? Is that what... <laughs> it's so <laughs> stupid. Well, I mean... Zendikar. It's, it's Battle for Zendikar. Yeah, this Zendikar. when Magic first came out. People would be like, oh, no, is this game even going to last a year? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no, like at camp... Stupid black lotuses. No, at camp, the kids are like, oh, what's magic? Magic seems stupid. Pokemon's way more popular. Pokemon has to be the popular card game. I was like, ah, uh, you simple, simple children. I told them that the black, how much the black lotus is worth, and they're like, oh, we should start playing magic now. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> yeah, we might get it in a booster pack. Yeah, they don't understand. Children. Yeah. Okay. okay, so for pack wars, you grab a pack, like we've done. Packs! And you uh, open it up and make sure that the cards are facing down so you don't see what you have oh, here. Also, anyone who hasn't played the set yet, there are flip cards in this one similar to Innistrad. So, um, yeah, they might show up, but don't say anything to the kids at home. <laughs> but we want flip cards because that means Planeswalkers. So well, then, yeah. then you just uh, sleeve the 15 cards, including the, uh, the land that it came with. And then you just uh, hold a normal magic game with five, all five colors. And Fun so fact, most of this video is going to be sleeving and de-sleeving cards. Yeah, very exciting. We'll let you guys know when you can go grab a drink or something. Yeah, but I mean, like, okay, so other unboxing videos is just that. It's just an unboxing. There's no action. <laughs> as much action as you can get, I guess, in a trading card game. Yeah, that's true. Right you are, Ken. <laughs> One day, Brandon, we'll make those costumes. Yeah, that's going to be fun. Yeah. It's probably also going to piss people off, depending on where we go. Otakon, people might take it the wrong way. Probably, because if you aren't, like, into anime, you're going to get yelled at, because God forbid well, you, like... Well, I meant because it's a, you're no, dressing but... up like a Japanese stereotype. Oh, yeah, but it's white people that would complain about it. <laughs> and you know that that's true. <laughs> right you are, Ken. <laughs> 
All right, you guys. So uh, for the first pack, we're using a pack that's probably about half land. So that shouldn't be an issue. Uh, who knows? What are you talking about? What? I don't even understand. No, like the deck's going to be like half land. Oh, yeah. 15 lands. Yeah. Oh, so what did you want to, for pack wars, did you want to keep just adding decks? Uh, or adding packs? Is that what we're doing? Well, remember when you add a pack, you're supposed to add one of each color. Like one more of each color. So uh, That seems like there would be too much if we did that. Uh, Mega Jaguar. Uh, we are in Delaware. <laughs> We're in the mystical land of Delaware. Yeah, you you can't see it, but we have the uh, we have the Atlantic City Grand Prix mat, and we also have uh, my local uh, card shop, all which is King's all the men. King's Men in Pittman, New Jersey. We have that mat as well. One of the two best places to play in the world. Yeah. Wait, Atlantic City and Pittman? No, I was talking about Pittman and Comic Mania. Oh, but you don't really play at Comic Mania. <laughs> you do sometimes. You usually can't because of work. Well, it's more that and I'm also not that good, and they're pretty competitive. So yeah, okay, yeah, they are. Okay, you want to roll a D20 <laughs> as it goes first? I guess so. Yeah, I guess so. I'm evil. i got to take this seriously. Oh, shut up. You go first. It was an eight. You've rolled an eight. Okay. I got a thirteen, which is five points more superior. <laughs> oh, I was thinking um, we should do a video of teaching people how to play, because like a lot of the kids wanted to learn how to yeah, play. But who's going to teach us how to play? Oh shush! Like a lot of the kids wanted to learn how to play, and it's like, well, I'm trying to explain it, and then they're not understanding because it's not Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh. So. Um, okay, so we... Opening hand, guys. You... Oh, okay, I'm gonna not look at the screen. Tell me when it's not on there anymore. No rares yet. Can I look? Uh, almost. Yeah, go. You're good. Okay. Here's my opening hand. It's pretty terrible. Don't get used to this. We're not always gonna show you guys our hand. Yeah. Or maybe we will. Depends <laughs> on how you behave. Okay, so, uh, no mulligans then? Just because we don't want to see all the other yeah, cards, exactly. I guess? Yeah, of course. Okay, so I'll go first. Yep. <laughs> Okay. Okay, so I will play a planes and pass to E. Thank you. Um. Okay. Let's go with a swamp, I guess. Pass turn. Okay. Okay. Island. That's her. Exciting. Let's go with a forest. Pass turn. Right? Pack Wars is so much fun, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> it can be. No, it, it is. It is. When we were doing our um, Gate Crash Pack Wars, that was pretty fun. Yeah, I mean, disappointing, but fun. Yeah, I mean, it's not that great of a set, but uh, the game was... By the way, it was Return to Ravnica. That's the set that you're most likely to get good stuff in, not Gate Crash. Oh, okay. Okay, uh, Knight of the Pilgrim's Road. It's a 3-2 with Renown 1, which uh, for you folks at home, that means that if you deal combat damage to your opponent, it gets a 1-1 one, one counter on it. Yeah, but it's only the first time. Yes, yes, exactly. It's like uh, the whole monstrous mechanic, where you can only make it monstrous once. Double monstrous! <laughs> That's... That sounds like a Yu-Gi-Oh thing. Yep. Let's go like with. The... <laughs> What's the other guy's name on that? Um, it's uh, uh Vic Romano. Oh, and Vic. Kenny Blank and Chip. Yeah. So then you. So clearly you're Vic then, and I'm Ken. I guess so. Because you keep saying that. I'm to like me. kind of a hybrid of both of them because I like making the jokes and pointing out. When yeah, I could be like Guy Le Douche. <laughs> Guy Le Douche. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, am I going now? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Uh, 
One, two, three, the most powerful card in the set, Guardians of Miletus. Oh, man. So the, zero, the, kids, six the kids that actually do know how to play, they think that that's a really good card because they I, see the six. I'm not going to lie. I actually thought this was a really good card when I first started, too. It was in my first. Deck. Yeah, it was It was from Theros. Because what I would do is I'd have two of them out, then I would Stratus walk one of them, so one was a flying zero six blocker. <laughs> He actually, he made it like a 3-9, though. So, I mean, and it was a 3-9 flyer. I forget what, it was oh, some yeah, older card. Oh, yeah, and then he used um, Assault Formation, right? So he could actually attack with it. No, I was telling him about Assault Formation. You don't, how would you know that? Huh? How would you know if he used this? One of the kids you know uses Assault Formation. Oh, no, that, no that, was at the, that was at the library. Oh. No, I was talking about the camp kids. Okay, uh, I'm going to swing for three to renown this guy. I cannot block, so he is now renowned. Uh, Renown him! We should get some actual dice. He is him. My turn? Yeah. Let's go with a planes. <laughs> um. Hmm. I still cannot do anything. Really? Yes. I guess you could say this is going to be a steal. <laughs> That's not even like, it doesn't even make sense. <laughs> Are you stealing something? Okay. Attack the four. Excuse me for eating the chips. I'm at 13. It's fine. Us magic players are a hungry bunch. Yeah, where's our Doritos and Mountain Dew? We I need... just had a glass of Mountain Dew. A glass of Mountain Dew. <laughs> That's fancy. <laughs> hey, guess what, Brandon? I can do something now. Oh, can you? I have all five colors. I'm going to summon Super Mega Chicken. Super Mega Chicken. No, I'm just kidding. Cool. I'm going to play uh, Cruel Revival to destroy your non-zombie knight of the blah 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 whatever. And you gain. It can't be regenerated and I could return up to one target zombie card from the graveyard to my hand. Oh, right, I don't have any. Zombie. <laughs> I'm done. Alright, my dear. Yeah. Pass turn. Hey, Brandon. What's, um... Two plus two? It's four. <laughs> Thanks for that. What's the the Josh that we know? What's his last name from... I okay. added him on Facebook, but I can't remember what his last name is. Is it Gold? That's probably... Maybe? I don't know. Josh, do you have tattoos? And if you are, do you also live in New Jersey? <laughs> I feel like I just described, like, a million people. Guys named Josh with tattoos that live in New Jersey. Yeah. Mountain, tapping five for Rock Smallers. Trample and Renown 2. This oh, is yeah. the first thing I've actually seen with Renown 2. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, my turn? Yeah. Okay. Uh, pass turn. Okay. Swampert. Okay. Um, four? I'll let it go. Okay. I'm gonna mighty leap him. And I'm gonna Titan Strength him, just so I can do stuff. Okay, he's now a six and three, a nine something or another. Not like it mattered because he didn't block. So nine at you. Uh, I'll take it. Well, yeah, you said you weren't gonna block. Okay, he now also has his renown counters. Oh no. And I'm scrying one. Uh, okay. I'll keep that. And I'll end my turn. Okay, my turn. Yep. Okay, this Josh says that he doesn't have tattoos. He's lived in Philly, moved to New York, played on the Pro Tour for a while, hung out with Alex Colic and John Williams. I know a John Williams, but I don't think it's the same one that you know. Um, I feel like since he's played on a Pro Tour, he's just like, what are these amateurs doing? Yeah. <laughs> well, we, we did a Grand Prix. <laughs> That's a thing. Okay. Um, I'm going to do this just because you me all the time. Oh, no. All its time. Active trees in that. Yep. I had a feeling. Okay. Great. So now it's doing even Attack more to me. Six. Great. 
Uh, okay, I'm at um, some number, which is seven. But yeah, Josh, I'll tell Steve that you said hey. Okay. Since that is what you requested. My turn? Yep, your turn. Cool. Let's go to the forest. All this land. And nothing to play. Tapping two for Elvish Visionary. When it enters the battlefield, draw a card. Nice. Yeah. It was land. Yeah. <laughs> so it doesn't even matter. I'll attack you for six. Celestial flare that. Oh. Yeah, I wanted it to get rid of Oh, snap. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I still have this mighty powerful 1-1 one, one elf. Mighty. My turn? Yeah. Okay, cool. Well, I guess that's why they call them cat wars. <laughs> we have a total of three people watching. So, for the two other people besides Soul Josh... Blade By the way, um, this was my rare for the pack. Oh, nice. You got the Soul Blade. Okay, so the two other people besides Josh, leave a comment. Say if we're doing good stuff or if we should change how we're playing, I guess. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Um, okay, it's kind of like he has uh, like a prowess ability. It's, yeah. Except it's not called prowess this time. I mean, we, he gives everyone prowess, though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's like mega prowess. So my turn. So you better watch out for my attacking defender. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Island. I have nine mana. I will end my turn. Okay. You're probably going to win. Alright, Jess. Good night. Bye, Jess. My sister is now leaving the house. Okay. okay. <laughs> Just like old times then? See you later, Jess. Alright. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, I used that last turn. Not this turn. You just yeah, you played yeah, that no, last turn. Yeah, I just started this turn. Okay. Yeah. I need to pay more attention. <laughs> okay. Uh, three, two, Undercity Troll, you mad bro? Got renown one, and for two and a green, I could regenerate it. That is definitely a troll. Yes, it is. Okay, attack for four in the air. I cannot block. Okay. I am at three. Alright, oh, you're good. Man, this gym's pretty good at attacking. I'm about to call him Jim Kazama. From Tekken. Okay, I was gonna say, I don't Can get... Can I get a thumbs up if anyone got the Tekken I don't, reference? I don't really play Tekken, so I'm not gonna get that reference right in. Just to give you a heads up. Planes! And, since I'm not gonna be able to do anything else, I'm gonna play Kythian's Tactics, giving my guy plus two, plus one until end of turn. And Spell Mastery activates, so he has Vigilance. I'm attacking you for three. I'm going to block this guy. Oh, no! <laughs> okay. Yeah, you win this round. Hold on, I want to see what I'm getting. I didn't even get my rare yet. <laughs> okay. Alright, well, wait, i got to see what mine is. I got Honored Hierarch. Oh, that's actually pretty As long good. as Honored Hierarch is renowned, it has Vigilance and Tap and one mana. That seems so, like a pretty good card. Yeah, attack, tap. Yeah. <laughs> you might actually be able to use that in Storm deck. Read the bones! A Storm deck, you say? Which could use a Volcanic Island, you say? <laughs> which I now will have when it comes from Russia. Yeah. If it comes from Russia and gets to me. Uh, but yeah, so... Make sure you grab the one... There's my land, so make sure you grab the land that isn't the lands you put in here. Alright, Yeah, so, uh, do you want to do... How many How many more pack wars do you want to do? We just have to save enough for two types of draft. Well, we're going to do a, a limited with six packs, so we need to save twelve. I mean... And then the drafts, we each need three, I think. Alright. Mm, excuse me. That's fine. I yeah. mean, you just want to, like, crack a pack right now, too, just to... Oh, sure, sure. That. Okay. There, I'm going to go. Yeah, I mean, I have enough sleeves that I could just leave these in sleeves if I wanted to, so t instead of just unsleeving them. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, this Honored Hierarch seems pretty good. All right, so do you both want to... Yes. Should we both do one? Yeah. 
Okay, so I got a Liliana pack here. I have a Chandra pack. So I'm sure a lot of the people that are watching this probably don't care about all the commons and stuff like that. So I'll just go through quick. Dragon fodder, yoke docks. Really? You're going to save them, though? Deadbird Shaman, Cobble Brood. Don't tell me how to live my life, Eve. Uh, Nivix Barrier, Orchard Spirit, Bellows Lizard, Topan Freeblade, Return Centaur, Claustrophobia, Warhorn. We got more. We got more. Years. Oh my god. A Pointer of Champions, uh, Jesse and Thief, and Vryn Wingmare was my rare. Alright, what is that? I can't see. Non creature spells cost one more to cast. That would be good in tiny leaders for annoyances. True. There's another couple of cards that are just like that. So I got a Caves of Coleos, which is the uh, ping lands <laughs> that Brandon hates so much. And I also got a foil. I actually don't dislike them that and much. And a goblin token. It's just like, they. Sh why would they reprint those so quick? You know? Yeah, I mean, that is a good question. They also reprinted tons of things from Theros, though. And, um,. And cons and stuff. That is true. And it's like, it, it, it's like if you just wanted to keep it in standard, wizards, then change how you were going to do standard stuff. Uh, you want to open up one more pack and then go into a pack wars? Yeah. So I'll take a Jace pack. Just, uh... Jacey Jace. Okay, uh... Yeah, that Liliana pack is kind of rough, so... Let's go with this Liliana pack. Uh, <laughs> you didn't even cheat it. Huh, another dragon fodder, okay. The goblins look like pissed off rats in this set. Ooh, I rose as champion. That was great in the pre-release because I was playing red white and that definitely helped. I got Erebos's Titan. It seems to be a mythic. Oh yeah, that's a really great card. It only costs four. Did I you almost got excited because I thought I got uh Gideon Oh Gideon, yeah. It like it. But it's just Gideon's Falons. Which is okay. Put four for six, uh five and two white. Put four 2-2 two, two white knight creature tokens with Vigilance onto the battlefield. Or Spell Mastery. Uh, it lets... Well, if there are two or more instant and or sorcery cards in your graveyard, creatures you control gain indestructible until end of turn. I haven't seen that many white knights since I went on 4chan that one time. hi -yo. <laughs> But no, seriously. Yeah. <laughs> okay, then. Oh, wait. We're... Oh, wait, hold on. I thought I had my phone plugged in. I, nope, I need to charge it. Okay, I'm picking another pack. Oh, okay. No, I'm talking about for, like, packs. Oh, okay, that's fine. That's fine. All right, got a Chandra pack. All right, can anyone answer this for me? Like, it might be a weird question, but is Chandra the card for the uh, same person in Young Pyromancer? Because it sort of looks like her, but not really. I don't know. What is what is that? Is Young that a Pyromancer's another it looks oh, like that. Oh, so, oh, okay. I thought that was like a book. That sounds like a book. No, it's not. It's a Well, you know that it could just be up to artist representation. I mean, it also kind of looks like a boy, but then again, I mean... Okay, there we go. I was going to say... A little, little bit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She she looks like a, a young ruffian. Yeah. Okay, you ready to do uh, yeah. this other pack war? Yes. Cool stuff. Yes. Let me just move these cards out of the way. By the way, uh, that Abzan deck you want to make uses um, Erebos Titan. So. Oh, yeah? Yeah, it does. Oh, yeah, because that, that Abzan deck is more heavily focused on black than my current Abzan deck. Okay. Um, I picked up a Gideon one. Gideon and his sideburns. Um, you got, like, a text or something. Yeah. No token. And no planeswalker, obviously. We would have seen it. Oh, so I actually uh, found out why the Modern Masters cards were kind of in uh, bad condition. Yeah, like really. Apparently, they outsourced that set. Which it's oh yeah yeah yeah. It's a it's, possibility it's not, they it, didn't want like the resale value to be super high on those. It wasn't made in the the normal factory, which is we looked that up one time. It was in like Sweden, I think. I think this one was made in Pyongyang. Pyongyang! Which is in North Korea. For whoever didn't get that joke. <laughs> um, what is it? The, the People's Republic? Yeah, the People's Republic of North Korea. It's a happy place. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's a little fat kid on the, on the corner. <laughs> <laughs> there's a little fat kid. Hey, buddy. 
interview was a movie. I liked it. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I it, it was it pretty like funny. Three times. Really, you did? Well, different people wanted to watch it. Oh, that's true. Oh, so we had the um, we had the kids like in the afternoon. We went to like a carnival thing that some of the other campers were putting on. Right. But like they they had to take it down like really early for some reason. So then it's like, well, we we didn't want the kids to go back into the Lego kits because then they would just mess it up again. So um, I was like, hey, do you guys want to watch like a movie or something? So then they were, and then I was like, well, what movie do you want to watch? And they all said Minions. And then they're like, how are you going to be able to get this? And I was like, don't worry, I got it. You should stop teaching kids how to pirate stuff. I was was telling them what the website was. Um, Don't say it over this. People could figure it out themselves. I'm not going to. But um, it was funny though because they kept saying like, "Is this illegal? Is this illegal?" And it's like the it's the same kid that was saying how he wanted to make a chainsaw robot so he can kill everyone. So it's like, I don't know it's what about as illegal as your chainsaw robot. I might get more time than you would. For that. <laughs> yeah, it would be a de- uh, bigger fine. That's for sure. Yeah. So it's like I don't even know what what you know. Wait, why is your deck so much more? Oh, did you include those other cards? Yep. Okay, that's fine. They're right here. Oh, that works. Okay. I forgot that you wanted to do that, but like I said, you were supposed to, were supposed to technically. Um... That's fine. We'll. I'll start over after this. I'll unsleeve and stuff like that. So. No, uh, what I was just trying to say is you're supposed to technically put in five more lands because now it's kind of like. I think it'll be okay. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it's fine. Because it's still only a thirty card deck at this point with fifteen lands. Yeah. So. Yeah. Well, actually, additional ones, because each pack comes with one. Yeah, exactly. And remember, I got a uh, Caves of Coleos, and I saw that I had Evolving Wilds as well. Yeah. Okay. You want to go first, then? Uh, sure. Since I lost. Okay. So then... Oh, and I taught, I taught the one kid that knew how to play Magic. I was telling him about the new mulligan roll. Oh, yeah. He was, like, pretty excited about that. He, he was playing, like, an 85-card deck. I was like, mmm... Maybe you want to uh, adjust to that. You wanted to play that 100-card deck at one point. Yeah, because it would have been funny. For who? The person beating you? Yeah. Now, well, if you're that into making... Well, a 100-card sense. deck is obviously going to be an EDH deck at that point. Yeah, exactly. Um, So, no, no mulligans, then? I mean, my hand's not bad. I only so. have one land. Oh. Can I mulligan? Yeah, go for it. Okay. Odds are, since the cards are not going to... It's not going to be a huge deal. Okay. This is where stuff gets crazy, because we might have two of one card and all that stuff. <laughs> Do you have two of one card, Brandon? No, tell I actually don't. Oh, okay. You were Ask just the like... people at home, they'll tell you. Okay, well, I didn't look, so... I'm just trying to... Well, if you're doing that... Alright, so I'm going to just do seven again, if that's okay with you. Mm-hmm. Okay. Play some magics. Yeah, this is um better. Forest. Caustic caterpillar. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I think. Yeah. I don't know. I can at least play something, so that's all that matters. Yeah, exactly. Your turn. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. I shall counter with a planes. It, it's too late to do that. My turn was over. <laughs> I know. I didn't mind attacking you for one. Okay. I go down to Nathy. Alright, my turn. Yep. Okay. Okay. Uh, play one in a planes. Well, tap you're one tapping. In a planes, sorry. For Topan Free Blade, it's got Vigilance and Renown One. Ah. Okay. Yep. So my turn. Yeah. What happens with that guy? He gave. What's he like? Mm, excuse me. I could. Uh, 
I could sacrifice him to destroy target artifact or enchantment. He basically has a uh, built-in naturalize. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, playing. I would have thought it would be like destroy target forest or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go eat everybody. Post. Okay. I got a I got a thing for you. Here. Wombo combo. Yeah, the wombo combo. Uh swamp tapping three. Right. Flesh bag marauder. When he <laughs> enters the battlefield, marauder. we each have to sacrifice a creature. Bye bye. Okay. <laughs> yeah. He's only a three one. But I got rid of your flyer. Oh, wait, this must be someone you know. Wait, no. Oh, since you tagged... Okay, I see. Don't give away their identity over the internet. No, uh, uh, never mind. Just to let you guys know, there's about to be a loud lady that sounds like she's from Long Island that's about to walk in. Oh. I just call her mom. <laughs> hey guys. Okay, uh, <laughs> I'm going to play Acolyte of the Inferno. Oh. And that has renowned one, and whenever it becomes blocked, blocked by, a by a creature, it deals two damage to that creature. Cool. We both have three ones right now. Yeah. <laughs> Here. Yeah, there's a lot of, um... Like, burn cards. Well, what I was gonna say, there's a lot of cards that aren't, like, even things where it's, like, a 1-1, one, one, a 2-2. Two, two. There's a lot of, like, 2-4s, 3-1s, things like that. Yeah, that is true. Oh, wait, you know what? I think Evan and his, uh... Evan and... I'm trying to remember which one of his friends said... Wait, is one of those Cubby McMouse? No. no? That, that's Evan, though. Because um, he was on here last time. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was going to say... Yeah, uh, Nick. His friend is uh, Nick. He's actually the one that was for the Uh cool. Nick, if you're here, thanks a lot for that. Man. We really appreciate it. Um, okay, so I'm going to... Oh, put down an evolving wilds. Huh. That's interesting. And... Um, I'll tie for three. Um... Okay, I'll take it. Okay. Uh, my turn? Yep. Okay. Any modifications? Um, no, actually. Uh, 17, then. Great. Uh, I'm gonna... Two... Uh, Undercity Troll. Oh, the troll again. Yes, exactly. Okay. <laughs> You're... Uh, at the end of your turn, I'm gonna sacrifice this. Um, I'm just gonna go for a melon. Alright, sounds good. Try not to look at everything. Yeah. Say man, fix destiny. Uh, you know, it's a funny day. Oh no, it's they're so nervous. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, got that. On tap. I'll keep draw. Um. Huh. It's interesting. But we'll do that later. Tapping three. No, wait, no. E. Hmm. 
Oops. You didn't see that. Maybe you did. I don't know. Okay. I'm going to talk to for Infernal Scarring. He gets plus two plus zero, and when he dies, I get a draw card. Okay. So I'm going to attack you for five. Okay. I'm going to block with him. Mm -hmm. but I'm going to put Touch of Moonglow, which. Uh, you, you know, you'd be killing it anyway. It's only got one. Yeah, but now you lose two life. Oh. <laughs> Rude. Okay, that's fine. So 15. Everybody's out of here, but I get to draw a card. Yep. So oh, it's basically kind of like you used like sort of like half of a uh, Reap of Bones, I guess, or something. I guess. No, wait, wait, what's it called? Uh, sign and Blood? Is that? No, what's Sign and Blood? Uh, I, I, I don't know. I don't Probably know. draw and lose life. Something like that. Okay, well, I'm done then. Okay. Oh, he's renowned, by the way. You oh. attacked me and I didn't block. That should have haste, but it doesn't. Yeah. I don't know, like some of the names like don't make much sense really. Yeah. Like charging. I was a champion. Ooh. Two two double strike. On. Yep. Pass turn, Brennan. Bones? Okay. Scry two? Mm hmm Draw two? Mm-hmm. Where's your There's two. Seven. Playing my land. I'll put out a fairy miscreant. And I will attack. Okay, I will take it. So, four total? Yep. Okay, my turn? Yeah. think that it's better to take the cards out because now it's like so much harder to get right, stuff well, out. Do you want to do that then? Yeah, next turn. Yeah. Or next I round. think I just got lucky with my land. I think you did too. You're good. So you attacked with that guy? Uh yeah, so four, five, six. So you're down to What? Seriously, Brandon? Alright, whatever. Pack war seems to be my lucky thing because I don't usually lose at it. Mm. Hmm. I mean I don't have my rare and I haven't seen it. So. Mm. Hmm. Are you 12? Yes. Okay. Cruel Revival. Ooh. And I actually have a zombie that I could return to my hand, which is my flesh bag. Marauder. 
So I end my turn. Okay. Oh. My head hurts wearing this. Cool revival. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> no, I had it. I, I was gonna do a thing. You were gonna do a thing. Yeah, I was gonna um play him again, so then you'd have to sacrifice that, and I would sacrifice this. Oh, that's a really cool looking <sighs> card because I thought it was Moss Opal for a second. Yeah. Oh man, <laughs> Alchemist file. That'd be kind of funny, Brandon. But that uh, would be funny. But I'd also be like, how the hell did this get in here? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I got another one of these. So what's that? We have three total from the pre-release now? Yeah, because I have the one. Cool. Okay. So yeah, let's, uh... Let's, I say... Uh... One more pack worse, and then maybe take a break, because... Yeah, well, The, the headset kind of hurts my head. Alright, guys, can eat, so... Cause well, we here, have... let's crack a couple more packs. Wait, wait. Okay, but remember... Let's just grab six for each of us right now, I guess. Okay, yeah. So you could grab from anywhere. Things. We probably would have been done like three times over by now. Yeah, but other people, they just open packs. They don't do anything with the cards. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, got okay. six for limited. So I need my six. Yeah. Alright, so let's crack some packs. Okay. Let's do one each and then we'll unsleeve to do one more card wars thing and then after that. You want to take the break after pack wars? Or? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, um, just, just grab the lands. lands. Yeah, make sure you grab the right one. Okay, so this is my other, this is my rare for that other pack. Exquisite like Firecraft deals 4 damage to a creature or player. If there are two more instant and or sorcery cards in your graveyard, it can't be counted by spells or abilities. So that could be good. Oh, cool, I got some dragon fodder. I was so annoyed I didn't get any in the pre release. That would have definitely helped. Yeah, definitely. Didn't matter, because I still won. Heat. Yeah, we both did. Uh, we both did pretty good with that uh, pre release thing. Yeah. If we had one more round, though, I don't know if I would have won that final round. So I'm okay with uh, tying for first. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Five, 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 five,
And then I guess we'll do like one more pack or is capable of opening Yeah, we can we can crack some more if you want. Alright, that works. Because pack wars is fun, but doing like twenty in a row is like Not fun. Yeah. Yeah, so do you wanna uh Grab one to crack. One's speaking to you. This one's speaking to me. <laughs> no planeswalkers yet. Not yet. It's not a big deal because I don't. Wait, really oh, was this pack wars or just opening? Just opening. okay. Like, I don't really like need any of the planeswalkers too too much. I know they're worth a couple of them are worth a decent bit, but it's just like hmm, I'm not worried. Well, I would like them just for, like, my collection, because, uh, I want to show you my new little binder thingy that I got. I saw it. I didn't open it, but I saw it. Oh, you saw it in my... Yeah, program? I caught it once. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's a four-by-four. Four. I thought it was bigger than that. Oh. That's fine. I would get... I got Chandra! Cool. I got Chandra. And the Liliana token. Oh, nice. Awesome. It's interesting that the foil was before that, but I have a foil in common. It's a foil goat. Not this is wrong. Chimera, but it's definitely a goat. <laughs> it's a goat, yeah. Yeah. <coughs> Yay, I'm excited. I told you that one was speaking to me. <laughs> I mean, that's the Planeswalker. Oh, yeah. What's Oil, that? Doctor Spy Network, and a Harbinger of the Tides. <laughs> awesome. That's probably going to be worth stuff. Harbinger of the Tides. You may cast Harbinger of the Tides as though that flash if you pay two colorless more. When Harbinger of the Tides enters the battlefield, you may return target tap creature and opponent controls to its owner's hand. So we both got foils and both got cool cards for that one. Nice. nice. Double rares. Yeah. Double rares. <laughs> Sweet. E. Okay, that's awesome. And okay, I'm she's going into a sleeve right I ordered now. Four of these because the deck I'm building. Did you order any yet? Yeah, I ordered four. Oh, I got about a dollar each, and the non-foils have already doubled, more than doubled to nice. two dollars and like sixty Did you? Cents. Do you remember how much the foil was before? Or no, I actually don't. I don't know how much it is now. I got the Chandras. Nice. Okay, cool. So we both did pretty good with that one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, uh, ready for uh, another pack more? Yes. Okay. Banana packs. Oops, I'm sorry, I looked at the top card. I forgot what we were doing. That's fine. Battle for Zendikar. Worldwide release, October 2nd. Ooh. Oh, it's October? Yeah. Normally that would be September. Yeah, they... It did originally say September. Um, I guess they're figuring out the whole, let's only have two things in each block thingy now. Yeah. But I got an elemental. Uh, and you said October 2nd? October 2nd is what it says on oh, the Oh, so they really didn't even do it that much. Yeah, no, probably about like a week. Yeah, something like that. Probably like two weeks or so. I don't know, usually it's all like around the 20th or so, is the actual. Yeah, I think it just um, has to do with, you know, how the uh, the blocks are going to be now. Yeah. Since this is... Origins is our last corset. Core core. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> the good thing, so far we haven't gotten any, like, double rares, have we? Nope. And we still have, you know, nine cart or nine packs set aside, and uh, it looks like four more left in there. You want to just crack those after this game, and then we'll take our break? Yep. All right, guys, so this is pretty much what we're going to do. I know you can hear me right now. I know you probably heard all that, but I'll just read you. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to play this round of Pack Wars, and then after that, we're going to crack two more packs each for you. Then we're probably going to take, like, maybe an hour break or so. Um, I don't think it'll take us that long to build decks. Oh, I, I oh, was, oh, you I meant, we were getting oh, yeah, 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 for food. Well, because, see, what I was thinking was maybe we should open up our, um, the six packs and make a, uh, limited deck. 
while or we're eating. Or if you want to just like, I don't know, what do you think? Because it's like, well, who wants to just sit here watching us think of what cards we want into our Yeah, exactly. Our okay, yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to take a little break. You guys go. Yeah, so then we'll play. It's we'll, Friday night, you know, play some video games or something. Yeah, we'll play um, three rounds with our limited deck that we make. And then um, we'll come back and we'll do the, the draft. Because that is something you have to have, like, it's like face down and all that stuff. Okay, yeah, that works. It's basically like a. Well, I mean, I guess because you can figure out where the Those are. planeswalkers are really going to mess with that. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Especially because it comes with that token card, which yeah. counts as a card. <laughs> but hey, I'm not going to complain if we get more planeswalkers. Alright, you choose when you want to go first. I'll go first. I got some foil. I've been getting really good hands. I'll just keep. I don't really have the colors I want, but that's okay. Let's go to the swamp. Pass turn. Okay. Forest. Okay. Okay. How's everything on Um, my coworker Brandon said that it's a little echoey, so. Uh, well, it's fine. I mean, that happens. So. Yeah. Well, also keep in mind, like, you are, you Your mic is probably picking up what I say, and yeah. my mic is probably picking up what you're saying. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's go to the mountain. Tapping two for subterranean scout. Faster. <laughs> okay. Uh, do you want to card? I wish I had more green, not all red cards. I lied when I said I had a good hand. <laughs> okay. Terrible well, poker face. Play a swamp. Uh, faster. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Island. Attack you for two. Okay, I'll take it. And then I'm going to tap three for a. Uh, oh, that guy's awesome. Your, so you your, uh, yeah, I know you have a thopter token. Yeah, Can I borrow it? Sure. Thank you. And it flames. Yeah, it does flame. Yep, and I am my turn. Okay. Oh my god, I don't need all these islands. <laughs> I mean, not islands. <laughs> I don't have any islands we're talking about. Alright. Okay, that's right. Well, we all know that that if you play magic, it's it's only blue. That's the only color that exists in magic. Well, if you notice, I have three lands on tap, and one's an island, Eve, so I would be careful. Oh, a little worried. <laughs> I'm going to play a forest. And... Uh... I guess I'll put out the brawler's plate. And I'm going to swing with all this. Uh, so what's that? Two, three, and one? What? It's two, two, and one. So that makes five. Oh, I thought that was a three. Nope. So I'm down to 13. Okay. Letter? Mm-hmm. Okay, really be careful. I have two islands on tap. That means you can play cancel. Yep. something I want to do, but I can't because you have nothing out. <laughs> and I also can totally counter whatever you're going to do. Yeah, well... <laughs> what, are you going to act with trees in it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Uh, let's equip the uh, Brawler's Plate to... I actually want to equip it to the Thopter. I'm just kidding. <laughs> you can't even cancel that. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to. That's not how it works. Shh, it's okay. <laughs> Brandon doesn't know what he's doing. Uh, let's go for... hey -oh. <laughs> Okay, Brandon. Uh, hitting you for... Probably two, seven. four... Yeah, seven. Uh, Thirteen is seven. So that would be six. Yeah. 
Not a six. Oh no. Pretty helpless, my hair. Yeah. Okay. Blue. Pass Oh man. You can play so many counter spells right I now. I, I, I don't even know what to do right now. <laughs> and I'm Brandon. <laughs> Forest. I need, a, I need the planes. Swing it with everything again. Oh, am I going to kill you? Yeah. Okay, I won't swing with that. Alright, what do you do? Okay. So, what am I down to? Like, four? You're at two. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to play a single starfish. Yay, mm -hmm. starfish, he's back. Yeah. Yeah, that's a cool card. I mean, the whole scry thing is nice. Yeah. The funny thing is, like, I... See our visions? Before I knew what was good about, like, scry. Yeah. Okay, uh, so I'm done. Yeah. <gasps> I literally just can't play it. You know, you, you, you can... Well, I guess, yeah. I go play this guy. What's that? When he enters the battlefield, I can return target creature to its owner's hand. I'm going to return my doctor. doctor. <laughs> uh, I mean, that's what I want to do. Have. No, I know. I was gonna tap to scry one. I'm gonna attack. You lose. <laughs> By the way. <laughs> oh, you did have something. Yeah. Oh. Oh, look, I got a golem. Mage ring responder? It doesn't untap during your untap step. It costs seven to untap him. Whenever he attacks, though, it deals seven damage to target creature defending player controls. Is that a foil? Yes. Nice. Very nice. Well, I mean, yeah. that's better than just the regular ones, Brandon. Wait, that's the second foil rare I got, I just realized. Yeah. I bet that shock, <laughs> that, that foil shock land's worth a whole dollar. And, and I got Knight of the Light working, which is oh, awesome, that was... because you totally could have used that. <laughs> yeah, that was my promo guy. He's pretty good. Damn, this is Yeah, really I got a foil, too, foil so. Too. Um, nice. Not a foil rare, but also a foil. All right. Crack some packs. Crack some packs, and then we're gonna take a break for wings. Yes. Um. Oh, we're all, well, we're also gonna open up our. Oh, excuse me. Our um packs for our limited little tournament thingy that we'll have. It'll be just like the pro tour, except I won't end up crying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I might still end up crying. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> I go for the inside. Okay. Ooh, jeez pack. I got a Liliana pack. Oh, cool. I got the uh, Animus Awakening card. Manor oh, yeah, the Manor I got this is Revelation. This is Revelation. Revelation. You scry five, then reveal the top card of your library. If it's a creature card, you draw cards equal to its power, and you gain life equal to its toughness. And then uh, I got Shaman of the Pack as an uncommon. It looks pretty good. <laughs> if you play an elf deck, it's good. Uh, when it enters the battlefield, target opponent loses life equal to the number of elves you control. So this would be great in that um, commander deck that has that elf commander. Oh, yeah, definitely. Because you probably have enough elves, elf. Okay. We're going to one. Yep. That's fun. Oh, here's another, uh, really hot pack. Ember Ma Hellion. Uh, trample and another red source you control with the advantage to a permanent. The player if he has done a challenge. Plus one to that permanent player, I'd say. Cool. I got the Spoiler of Souls. It's a 3-1 for 2. Oh, this would probably be good in uh, Black Devotion. Yeah. Can't block, but you can pay... Or you can uh, tap two swamps to exile two other creature cards from your graveyard to return him from the graveyard to the battlefield. Oh, nice. So that's probably uh, going to be useful. Okay, so how are we doing this whole thing? With the, uh, with the break and stuff like that. Well, we got to grab our packs. 
for limited or for the for limited. So the, the draft the draft will, will be doing like this. Okay. But just only because we have to go through six packs. Okay. So what are we doing? Here? Uh. Should we just open them and then reveal what we have to the to the audience or something? Just not to each other. I don't. I don't really know what to do. Um, Whatever you want to do, Brian. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I guess we could just probably like take the break real quick and like. It depends, like. Because I want to go and eat, but I want to do this while we're eating. Okay. You want to just do that then? Yeah, but I, I didn't know. Should we like open these and then be like, these are the cards we got, and now we're gonna go and make a deck from them. I mean, I think it'd probably be more exciting if. Uh, you know, we get it, like... But, okay, so... <laughs> like, you know, like, they didn't know what we had, but... They might oh! See. Okay, well, you know, that that might be good. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Alright, so what do you think? Like, yeah, so... Around? Yeah, that that sounds good. So around, like, ten or so, we'll come back on. Okay. Fine. And then I'll make, I'll make another post Well, what time is it? Make sure you... <laughs> <laughs> it might be ten now, you... Um... You know, oh yeah, it's it's nine fifty four. Okay, so at eleven we'll call back. All right, that works. Yeah, I think that that sounds good because then it's like, well, are we still live right now? Yeah. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching so far. We'll be back at eleven. The good thing is that we actually have all this figured out, so it's not going to be like, oh yeah, we'll start at eight. We'll, we'll actually start right at eleven with limited. Okay, so thanks for watching. Up and until now. <laughs> that is. <laughs> Stay classy, San Diego. I forgot to change it from it saying Pack Wars featuring Gate Crash, so I'm gonna go do that now. <laughs> Wait, so it's that the whole time? Yes. That's hilarious. Yeah, well, it's not like it really matters. That's okay, just we're the all title on now, Twitch. Right? Uh, in two seconds, uh, we will be. Okay. Oh no, two seconds. I was just about to reveal the secret to living forever.